while we're talking about kits, I should bring up these unique floors that have the vending machine on them and can be seen on the floor route screen. I'm unsure if the whole floor is just a vending machine floor, kind of like safe area, or if it if you have the option to use the vending machine before entering or after clearing the floor. But these vending machines allow you to change the sub and special weapons, allowing for more kit combinations. This is exciting news because being able to use weapons uh, with kits that you're more familiar with and enjoy a little bit more is good news and this isn't something we're able to do in the normal Splatoon 3 gameplay. So it'll be exciting to make custom kits, uh, especially while trying to survive these difficult floors. Although I'm unclear on the cost of swapping around weapons, I assume it will likely cost you Mimbox, which is what we earn by clearing floors. So make sure you earn enough by clearing tougher difficulties while you're climbing the tower so you can use the vending machine when you reach them. 